Hello and welcome to this uh, tutorial on conducting a literature review. My name is Chris Mean. I'm an academic skills librarian here at NUI Galway Library. Uh, this resource uh, has been remixed in large part from the three resources that are listed at the bottom of the screen here. And they're all really good resources. Um, if there's any aspects to uh, this presentation that you feel could be filled in a little bit more, uh, you'd like to know a little bit more about, um, you know, this or that, whatever it is, um, uh, certainly I would recommend checking out the uh, one or more of those three resources as, as a follow-on. Uh, they're, all, they're all really excellent. Uh, the learning outcomes for this are as follows. Uh, how to engage in a search of the literature in a critical way. Uh, defining and refining a clear and focused topic and research question, uh, coming up with a search strategy, and then tools and techniques uh, that you can use to help refine your, uh, your strategy. I'm going to start just with a couple of definitions of the literature review. Uh, so this is uh, a definition that comes from a book that's part of the uh, collections here at the NUI Galway Library. Uh, so this is from Anu Buzi and Frels. Uh, and they say that the gen a general literature review uh, provides a review of the salient and critical aspects of the most current knowledge regarding a topic of interest and includes substantive findings as well as conceptual, theoretical, and or methodological contributions to a particular topic. So I take this to be a kind of a, uh, an example of a kind of a descriptive literature review, which could be the case um, you, that you're being asked to do something that's kind of descriptive, that summarizes uh, the key points of a particular body of work on a, on a, on a topic. Um, but very often you'll be asked to be uh, undertaking a kind of a critical engagement uh, with literature. So, um, so I think the second definition might get a little bit more uh, uh, at that type of literature review. Uh, and so Ridley here defines it as your opportunity to engage in a written dialogue with researchers in your area, while at the same time showing that you have engaged with, understood and responded to the relevant body of knowledge underpinning your research. So um, I like this idea of the dialogue, uh, of, of engagement and response. So you're not just sort of um, summarizing or consuming this sort of knowledge, you are, um, uh, you are actually engaged in a conversation with it. Now, um, this sort of body, this idea of the body of knowledge still to me seems a little bit too uh, pat uh, a little bit as though, um, you know, the literature were this, you know, a kind of an organism with, uh, you know, these functioning parts that all go together in this really, you know, nice sort of effective way. Um, what you'll often be doing is actually pointing out where the literature is in con there's where there's contradictions in the literature, where the literature sort of falls apart, where um, uh, where there's gaps in the literature in particular. Um, so um, so that's a, a, certainly a part of um, what I think of as the, as the critical engagement uh, with literature as part of a, 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 a literature review that involves critical engagement with, with, the, uh, with the literature.